Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video I will talk about a custom function Twitter map as you can see it over here. So this is the function which is not present in the Twitter R library and uh, to get this you know you need to go to this this particular link and uh, get this particular function. So this function is basically helpful in visualizing the followers, the followers that is following you and the person that you are following you can visualize that information to get an idea about uh, the your statistics in terms of uh, from which location so Australia or Asia Pacific or not or uh, South America from where you know the people are really following you so before I show you this thing in action I'll just show you the visualization to get uh, get you excited with so here is the uh, the Twitter followers as map for the real Donald Trump so that's the Twitter handle for Donald Trump and as you can see by color you have uh, the information that Asia from Asia there are like 41 followers and from Africa from North America from South America all of that information is basically visualized here with the help of the uh, with the colors and that basically uh, helpful to understand wherever the information is more dense that means uh, you have more followers so how to get or how to create this kind of a map well as I show you here over the code that first of all you need to source this Twitter map function from this particular link I will paste it uh, either in comments or in uh, or in description so that you can directly use it so first of all you need to get the source like this put it in a double quotes and press control enter and after that you need to set up the Twitter authentication this thing I have already told you I think uh, in one of the previous videos about how you can set up the Twitter authentication if you have not seen that I will recommend that you look my previous videos where I have uh, talked about I think very first video I've talked about this so after this set up the Twitter connection and then what you can do is simply use the Twitter map function after once you use the Twitter map it has certain parameters as mentioned over here I will talk about it in a couple of minutes so what it takes as a first argument is the username or the Twitter handle as mentioned over here and then the maximum numbers of followers or num people that you are following should the count should be thousand and this is limited to thousand or or 2000 is basically to to avoid that scenario where you have millions of user followers or hundreds of thousands of followers but it is restricted by Twitter that uh, the number of uh, followers or the number of data points that you can get it back so it's always advisable that, that you are limiting this so once you click it or press control enter to execute the command it will take a couple of seconds so it's basically saying that it is getting the data from Twitter this may take moments so what it takes is basically uh, the user details as well as their longitude and latitude information as it will display in a couple of seconds over here like this getting geographic latitude and longitude of Twitter user and then it will print it so Twitter is basic so this will probably uh, print the file here in the Twitter map.pdf here in this case uh, it has given me the error the reason is because the file is already open with me here so what I need to do I need to close this so let me close this entirely and then run the command again so we will see this entire piece running it again so I am pausing the video for a couple of seconds so that once the information is there I will show you again all right uh, I'm back after around 10 or 15 seconds and uh, now the information is properly plotted to the file twitter.pdf the file name that is specified as this argument if we are not specifying anything then this is the default uh, name that will you know a file will get and just a few warning messages I'll in ignore it for a moment I will open up the file and I will point it over here Twitter map click it over here and I can see it at the rate real Donald Trump followers map so with that information 
you can get any public profile in this Twitter map function and get it plotted on the Twitter map PDF. Well, you have the option of uh, changing the file name with this parameter file name. So you can plot n number of maps. So suppose that you are trying to do the comparison of the maybe different products or different political profiles or different celebrity profiles. You can keep on changing the file name and keep getting the information just to know how popular they are and in which region, which is kind of a strategic information. So this, this is how uh, you can basically get uh, with all these parameters, the username, uh, user location, which is uh, optional, again, file name and number of maximum count that you want to get back. Plot type, you have the options that you only want followers, following or both. So you can give that information and accordingly get the data back from the uh, from the Twitter. So that's pretty much all for this video and I will meet you with a new topic in a new video.